Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. More 20 minutes till dawn tonight. Uh, last time we, we got a win. Got a couple wins, actually. Um, first night, right out the gate, we win. Hooray. We cleared the game. Um, tonight we're gonna work on some unlocks. We'll play the rest of the characters that we haven't played. Uh, once we unlock them, of course, and then all the other weapons, too. And then we might, um, uh... We might get into some, some of the endless mode, too. We'll see how far we can get there. But, uh, let's see. I don't know that we... Okay, we've got plenty of money. Let's unlock a new character. Every six shot, shoot out a frost butterfly. Okay, yeah, the ice character. All right, got it. Let's do it. <laughs> hey, Firetron, how you doing? Good to see you. Don't worry, typing is very hard, as it turns out. It's a very difficult thing to do, uh, regardless of the status of your sobriety, or lack thereof. Um, all right, so we did revolver, grenade launcher was fun. Uh, cyclone S word was not particularly fun. Um, oh, we have watering gun. That was did that that was a mystery unlock. I don't recall buying that one. Uh, salvo knife was okay. SMGs were fun. I did like that. The bat gun was very fun. Um, all right, I guess let's try the watering gun. I I don't remember having that uh, before. So standard, uh, so we can do the whole darkness thing and unlock shit and and do all that. So let's go. Let's do those. Um, and then we can play... Let's play a temple. We need to do a temple clear and a pumpkin patch clear too, so, you know. All that fun stuff. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Good to see you. Um, it's not new headphones necessarily. I did replace the pads, though. Um because the old ones were getting very, very worn and very, um, very shetty. <laughs> they were starting to come apart. So I had to find some new ones, and I got some new pads, but the, the headphones themselves are not new. Um, it's just the, the normal stuff. Um, okay, let's see. Uh, man, I don't, I don't know if I like the water gun. It's very short range. But, as long as we're gonna be doing this, let's, let's do the double short range, why not? Also, what's with this deal that's orbiting me? Is that, uh... Well, that might be, like, the... The, the darkness thing? I don't know what that is. Well, it's, it was a free orbital, I guess, so why not? Oh, maybe it's part of the water gun, actually. Yeah, yeah, oh, look at that, oh, that's cool, okay, yeah, we, we give it... We give it water, and it does the thing, and it does more than we normally do, so that's cool. Um, we're already a frost thing, but we're gonna add more, because more frost is more better. That's kind of cool. Alright, so if shit gets, uh... It's real rough and hard to deal with, we just water the flower a bit, and it, and it does the work for us. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot, in fact. Um, oh yeah, the dragon, the dragon would be a nice thing to have early, wouldn't it? Oopsie. Also, be good not to touch things unnecessarily. Okay, there's there's dragon. Let's take dragon. Why not? Lean into some orbitals and some summons and and what have you, right? Yeah, the spears weren't bad either. Honestly, all of the all of the uh, little companion summons things have been pretty good. Like those are all very nice. Like even the the ghost friend was good. A little weak at first, but what are you gonna do? Um, okay, we're gonna lean into some of our, our summon stuff. Which, I think the, the summon boosts might boost the flower thing, too. Which is even better, as it turns out. Soon, we will hardly have to not do anything at all and just let our summons do the work, right? Hey, game over. How you doing? see ya. Um, can we get more? Oh, there we go. There's the Aged Dragon. 15 damage every 60 seconds. Give. Even works while it's in the egg. I like that. That's good stuff. Oh, we are now very hurt. So I think there's two more dragon-specific things that we can get. The other side of that chain and then the, and the last one, the bottom one, whatever that happens to be, right? I'm hoping we get sooner rather than later. Uh, 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 uh. Alright, magnetism's good too. Like, let me very freely do the things, right? A 
pulled pork flatbread pizza. Oh, that sounds great. We have a we have a pizza joint locally that does a pulled pork pizza, and it is fucking delicious. Exactly as delicious as it sounds, which is amazing. All right, let's add some lightning. This dude was uh, keyed off there. There we go. Come on, buddy. <laughs> do a do a big explode so I don't have to worry about you. There you go. Okay, we are getting a little bit far north here. Oh, there we go. Uh, someone's had. Okay, this is just a general summon thing. We'll take that. Shit out of it. We could use some movement speed too. General survival skills. Thank you. Could you? Thank you. <laughs> Explode and take him with you. Thank you. Um. Okay, I mean more pickup range too. Oh, there was a thing still there. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Oh, that was dumb. Okay, that was probably on me. Let's be honest, that was on me. Let's just try that again immediately. <laughs> Throw that first run right in the trash. It's fine. That's okay. Now we've got even more opportunity to get the, the dragon stuff. So let's go for the dragon stuff. Although, you know, double shot off the gate is pretty good too. Proves our, our watering capabilities. significantly, as it turns out. Um, okay... Boop, 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 boop. Mm. Alright, well, let's take electricity, too. Why not? What I do wish we had and what's missing with this particular option turned off is a way to just manually reload. I know there's that auto reload option that just uh, reloads for you whenever you let up, but that just feels like a a poor replacement for having just a manual reload button. Looks like the plant does kind of contact freeze as well. That's nice. I like that. Let's just lean into our summons here. Whether it's a dragon or not, right? There was a manual reload in the keybind. Is there? I thought I looked. We can look right now. Let's look right now. Fuck it. <laughs> we got nothing else to do. Let's look right now. I thought there was not. Yeah, there's a shoot. Oh, there is a reload. Is there not? I'll have to check all the buttons on this here gamepad and see. Um, get out of here with this, I suppose. All right, let's check all the buttons. Not right bumper, not left bumper, not left trigger. It's X. Oh, why do they put it on X though? I want it on a button that I don't have to move my thumb to get to. Mm, it stinks. Oh well, but it does exist. You're right, Arjun. It does exist, and I'm just an idiot. Um, do we have a thing that does the thing for my summons? No. All right, let's add fire then. I suppose I could go through the whole rigmarole of, of doing a remap perhaps in an external program to do such a thing, but that will have to wait. Okay, there's Dragon Egg. 
It's fairly early, only about two minutes in. We'll take it. That's serviceable. This is about when we had it last time anyways, when these big explodey idiots started showing up. Get all of the dragon stuff, please? No? Okay. That's fine. Whatever. Oh, I don't use any of the steam remapping stuff. That doesn't quite play very well <laughs> with most of my things. More often than not, having steam input turned on uh, breaks the controller entirely. I don't know why. I haven't been arsed to try to figure that out in a long time. But maybe one day I will look. Not now. Today is not that day. Um, jeez. Uh, it's fucking not giving me the stuff that I want. I want the dragon related stuff. And they are not obliging this time. I don't like it. Well, it's not necessarily dragon-focused, but summon, that's fine. Okay, let's grab this while we're here. What does this do again? Oh, it's just like a character-specific one, right? Which is fine. Oops, we took a, a bop there for not a particularly good reason. Ow! Oops. He exploded a little bit sooner than he should have. Oh, where's all my dragon shit? Come on. Oh! Oh, why did that like, explode super early. Wait, I had, like, another half second to get the fuck out of there. Ugh. Boo! Alright, I'll try it again. That's fine. I think our, our glare procs were doing damage whilst it was trying to an explode. So that's why I was doing it early. Okay, that's alright. I mean, as long as we're doing a little bit of science... While we're on our way to dying, that's fine. Like that's okay. That's a it's a worthwhile endeavor. Um, okay, there's super early dragon egg. Okay. Make up for it all. Now, that needs to be followed immediately by the other dragon things though, because otherwise it's just not gonna make any difference. Ugh, nuts. Okay, let me fire them. Dragon. Alright, uh, give me magnetism first then. We don't have to walk nearly as far to get this stuff. Hey, dragon! No. Alright, how about, uh, more ice then? there. That's alright. Uh, jeez, wow. 
Getting the raw end of the RNG now. additional damage whilst they're doing an explode, I guess. Ugh! Fine! Give me movement speed. Ugh. Oh my god, <laughs> getting no, no dragon things, no dragon specific things, I hate it. Come on, going for a, a very specific build here, and they are denying me, hardcore. Next run when I'm not gonna do dragon shit at all, that's when they're gonna be like, Hey, you want a dragon thing? I'll be like, no, <laughs> stop. Uh summons deal fifty summon damage to nearby enemies every two seconds. Okay, sure. That sounds fun. Okay, oh I think Dragon Friend's about to uh about to come on out and do pretty much nothing since he's got no upgrades. That's alright. He'll he'll try his best. And we'll be right there with him. Okay. Uh bloodsuckers. Summon damage plus ten percent. Every five hundredth enemy killed by a summon drops a healing item. Uh yeah, that sounds good. Seems good. I just need to make sure. Our, I wonder if does our flower count as a summon? If so, then we are gonna be swimming an extra health that we won't need. Maybe. <laughs> oh no! What? Why did that one just suddenly blow up? God damn. <laughs> mm. Shit. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. It's it's okay. It's fine. We'll we'll do it a third time, fourth, third time, right? Or just run four? I don't remember. Who can say? <sighs> okay. Well, there's early dragon egg again. That's that's fine. Okay. Step one complete. <laughs> Now, we just need the appropriate follow-through. Uh, uh, oh. Alright, well, oh, haste is fine. In fact, haste might actually be better. Then we can get this shit Quicker, faster, more upgrades. this time. No. No why, though. Um, but, but fine. Curse. Sure. 
we get the thing w which lets all our summons do the the bullet effects, then we'll be in business. For now, I'm looking for very specific things that it just does not want to give to me. Oh my god! Alright, fine. Ghost friend, help us out. are either slightly homing or much stronger homing than I would expect. It seems like it protects us a great deal. Oh my god, there's a dragon thing. It's about a two minutes into his fucking hatch time, but that's alright. It's okay, we can make that work. Oh, that's a lot of explodes. Excuse me. Ow! Near that one, I thought. Okay, and then there's the other one. Alright, good. See, where was that, like, immediately on level 2 and 3? Jerk asses. friend going a little bit better there and we'll get whatever this is. Frozen enemies take more damage. Hell yeah. Give. Ow. Okay. I guess I walked into that on one on my own. It's fine. Oh, okay. Uh... Dragon friend is hatched, I think. Um, alright, it was an extra collect range. So we don't have to get too close to things. <laughs> get close enough to set them off, but it doesn't work when they're frozen. Um, okay, there's spears. Let's grab spears as well. Might need to invest in a health thing sooner rather than later, huh? Oh! Or I can just die. Because I did not see the biggest idiot right next to me there. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. So okay, I want to make this build work because this is a very interesting weapon. And I honestly really kind of appreciate the starting ice as well. Okay, so no immediately starting dragon, that's fine. Like, we can delay a, a few seconds on that, no problem. Um, I would prefer not delaying too long, though. Alright, let's take the early soul shield, then. So we get okay, so we've got an extra little heart, and we get another one every 90 seconds. Up to what, three or four, right? 
So, okay, let's play the survival game, I guess. Instead of going typical glass cannon idiot game, you know? Ugh! Still nothing. Okay, well, let's sum it up then. Although, that's kind of problematic with a bunch of explodey dudes. Although, I think the scythe will take care of the, the small explodey dudes without an issue. It's the big ones, perhaps, that we should be a little bit frostier about. Uh, okay, movement speed's good. Spears in there, too. Better be on our way to Pop Machibo for having all the summons, too. Not that Chibos really matter, but it would be nice whilst we're doing this. Oh, and I just heard another heart pop there, so that's good. <clears throat> Bullets deal 10% damage, plus 10% for each soul heart you have. That's pretty neat. Um, and then there's just a straight up shield, and then blah blah blah, curse, blah blah blah. Okay, let's do curse. Power up our scythe a bit, huh? There, finally, Dragon Egg. Two-ish minutes in. Uh, I guess that's not too late, right? We do tend to level up rather rapidly. So, okay, so it'll pop at about 14 and a half. We just need to survive and get a whole bunch of other things to help him out. We can do that. one of them. Yeah, all right. That's good. Oh, oopsie. <laughs> Pop right into him. That's fine. That's okay. Make it work. Uh, an additional butterfly. Okay, sure. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> it's fine. Whatever. Um, okay, let's get our spears going better, I guess. Okay, so we got an additional soul heart back. missing two of the dragon things. But hey, let's get Ghost Friend in there too. Why not? Now we're talking. Now we've got, what, four? Well, soon to be four summons, right? Let's Dragon Friend hatches. So we got the Scythe, we got the Spears, we got Ghost Friend. I guess we can count the flower as one. So that'll be five then. speed plus 10 percent damage is increased by bonuses to my move speed which i've got good move speed too so hell yeah faster stronger etc all 
Oh, right, and then the 90-second little soul heart thing, too, which is great. Means I have to worry less about the whole health situation, right? I mean, that's the idea, anyways. Oh, look at that thing! Oh, that's, that's a big one coming in. Okay, uh... Yeah, alright, make this in, please. Okay, yeah, ice and ice and whatnot is gonna be doing the work here. Maybe encouraging a few uh, additional explodes on his person there. Oh, well, I mean that works too. <laughs> Whatever. There you go. Kaboom! Boom! Boom! Bam! Boom! Bam! All right, that probably did a a buttload of damage. Oh, excuse me. There we go, got him. Eat shit. Uh, total stillness. Walk speed down? No. Get out. Uh, vitality, health up, and then might. Uh, increase max HP, increase all damage by two for each max HP that I have. Uh, yeah, that sounds good. I wonder if the soul hearts factor into that as well? Because that would be cool. I doubt it, because it didn't mention soul hearts, but... One can dream. The bank HP upgrades and the roll for blinding hot curry for double. <laughs> right? Wait a minute. That doesn't sound like the right game. A good game though it'd be. That is not the right game. Um Like we've got. Oh, our dragon friend is ready now. I guess we are in the sub 14s. That's good. Wish we had a, a summon friend that blocked projectiles. Perhaps we can yet get one of those. Thank you. Uh, okay, there we go. There's the. Okay, there's the other dragon one, right? Okay, so that one's not time-based, so uh, yeah, let's let's do additional additional dragon friendship, I guess. All right, now this build's coming together. Got things doing our bidding left, right, and center. Do 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 electricity. I think we got both of those, both of the time ones. Uh, let's see. Uh, whoop and top center in that in that little left hand columns there. Oh no, we don't have the second one. Ah, boo. Well, we got one of them. We got one of them really early. So that's good. Like I'll take a one and two win, I suppose. We can get the second one yet. Uh, every 500th enemy killed by a summon drops a soul heart. That's pretty good. Magic Spear gains 15 damage every time you gain a soul heart? Yeah, gimme. Okay, and then we got a free one there, so free damage boost. Yoinkaruski. Oh, okay. That's fine. You know what? Losing a soul heart is okay, because I don't think we can gain more than three from the time one. Um, bullet steel plus 10% for each soul heart. What is this? Gain a soul heart. Increase max limit of soul hearts by plus two. Oh shit. Yeah, gimme. Never mind. We are now pretty much limitless. Well, as far as the time of this run is probably concerned. <laughs> okay, I 
just heard another one pop there. Ooh, now things are getting getting crowded up in here. That's all right. Uh, another max HP there. Summon just a straight up summon damage boost. All right, so everybody's gonna be doing an additional thirty percent. And uh, probably not a moment too soon, considering the crowd that is building here. Oh, nice, and uh, here's our uh, our weapon upgrade. Fire rate plus 20, bullet range. Okay, and then with the magic spray, the, the on-hit effects is pretty good. And damage is increased by bonuses to bullet damage. Uh, no, let's do magic spray. We've got so many effects going on. Like, why not do everything? Excellent. Okay, can we do even more? <laughs> even more things. What do we got there? Uh, summons deal 50 summon damage to every two seconds. Okay, yeah, well, we got a lot of summons. Let's have them do even more damage. And all of them are orbiting around me in some respect, right? So, hell yeah. Oh, baby. Okay, there's the other dragon one. Every 60 seconds? Well, we got 11 minutes left, yeah? Let's go. Let's do it. Better late than never, I guess. That's the last dragon-specific one, I think. Attack speed plus 30%, alright. <laughs> it's like I was trying to just trigger him, and he ended up exploding from damage before he was uh, gonna just blow up on his own. I fucking love it. All right. Um. Okay, another new summon, the Electro Bug. Sure. Yeah, look at that. So many friends. I do like that the flower has a slight red outline, though, so I can tell where to fucking shoot. Otherwise, I would get lost in the melee here. Um, Scythe Mastery, Thunder Spawns. All summons have a 30% chance to do lightning, yeah. Okay. Seems good. I mean, they're doing enough damage output really on their own. Okay, and then even more lightning. Even more lightning, please. I don't know if we've got the frost upgrade yet. Probably not. I might have skipped over that for something more important at the time. Now having it would be nice. Oh no, a new enemy type that is not even able to get onto the field before getting vaporized. I love it. <laughs> uh. Oh, it's got little attracto bullets, though. I don't like that. I don't like that very much at all. Alright, uh, okay, it's lean into fire now. More fire. Excuse me. Just ran right into that one. Oh, okay. Snipe me from the bottom there. Good try. Thought that I have enough indirect damage that I don't need to use my main gun on anything that's approaching me. Oh, okay. There's the other, uh... The 10 minute boss? Seems like he's showing up late. Day late, dollar short, etc. Ow. Okay, uh, 
what's that? Increase summon damage by 1% after every 15 enemies. Where the fuck was that earlier on? Oh man, okay, that's great. Okay. Like 1% is kind of low, but you know, every 15 seconds. Fucking gimme. Also, whatever this is gonna be. Double how often the frost butterfly freezes or damages, hell yeah. All right, now shit be really popping off here. And we've got big explodies back. And now our damage output is such that we can safely dispose of them without getting close. I'm into that. comes the other larger chompy boys, huh? Okay, and there's the basic bitch frost, finally. Gimme. Which actually comes at a very ideal time, since we're gonna need to slow everything down. I wanna do something about our reload speed as well. minutes remain. Uh, we're a little late for the extra soul hearts on summon kills there. Let's beep up our fire. Dragon friend will no, no, no doubt be happy about that. in which direction to go. That's alright though, I think we've been kept at our our max four soul hearts for a bit there, so I wouldn't doubt that we're about to refill it again soon. Uh, summon attack speed plus 15% summons have a 15% chance on hit to instantly kill. <laughs> Give immediately now, thank you. Like, 15% is pretty low, but at the rate that these things are attacking for me, it may as well be 100%. Oh, there's a quote unquote boss, I guess, huh? Oh, it's very scary. Very scary. If it can ever get unfrozen. <laughs> But it will not, since our number of projectile output is uh, very large. And chance of freeze is also suitably large. Okay. 
except it kind of caught me looking there because I was busy with other things. That's all right. Tome of Electro, reload rate good, bullet damage down. Well, whatever. My bullets don't really do much damage to begin with, so I don't really care. All lightning on last fire again. Tome of Stillness, Tome of Power. All right, no, no, no. Give me Tome of Electro, please. Thank you. Pretty much relying on... Oh, shit, look at all that lightning. Pretty much relying on all of our knock-on effects to do the damage, so I don't give a shit about anything else. The inflict burn, there's a 0.05% chance to heal for 1 HP. Hmm. <laughs> um. Hmm. 0.05%. What is that? One in every 2,000? You know what? I'll play those odds. It probably only applies to real health and not the soul health thing, but you know what? That's okay. Likelihood of us actually getting down to real health is pretty low. I mean, granted, we don't have any extra soul right now, but... <clears throat> Present waves, I think, will be okay. Fire rate... Uh, more stuff. There's the other scythe thing. Okay, sure. Didn't really fully read what it was, but it said more damage, so I took it. better ghost stuff. Um, also triggers on hit effects. Oh yeah, gimme, 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 gimme. Okay, so now <clears throat> flower projectiles are doing the on hit effects. Ghost friend projectiles are doing the on hit effects. I won, oh, I think our uh, spears are also doing that. So yeah, <laughs> shit be popping off. No matter uh, what happens to be firing here. <laughs> right? Look, hey. Uh, it should be well known at this point, like, glass cannon builds are my big fave. So if it says more damage, it's a pretty good chance I'm taking it. Um, Alright, we'll put on smite as well. Oh, there's another boss-ish thing, I guess. <laughs> when did he show up? He's not going to be long for this world. But it's cute of him to try, I suppose. Uh, more dodge, more power when we've got soul. Shield. All right, let's give me the damage boost for soul heart seconds. We've only got the one presently, but it doesn't preclude us from getting more. There, it's dead. Good job. Uh, frozen enemies take more damage. Okay. We can pop ourselves to level 40 before all is said and done here. That would be kind of nice. What's this? Gain a soul heart. When you lose a soul heart, enemies also lose 80% of their max health. Oh shit. Gimme. <laughs> like, we're... Ideally, we don't proc that ever because we don't want to lose health, but... Like, if we do, it is gonna fucking cost them. See, look at that. Beautiful. Wow, that, that clears the room. Doesn't it? Damn, I like that. Okay, um, and then wind magic, sure, okay. 
So we were missing one of the elements, weren't we? Oh, there's the wind. Okay, I was like wondering, when was it going to show up? Okay, it's 39. Okay, vengeful ghost. Okay, more bullets, please. Oh, okay, took a bop there. That's all right. Just barely get to level 40, I think, before shit starts happening. Oh, we're gonna be just barely not there. Boo! <laughs> but we win! Hooray! We did a win! Good Jorb. And we also got to, wow, a full extra column of shit, too, because we did so good. And a lot of money! A lot of money to spend. Hey, Strat Lobodnar, how you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, I, I imagine Vampire Survivors was a very strong inspiration for this game. Uh, but it is very fun. Very fun, very stylish. A bit less, like, sensory overload than Vampire Survivors, which I can get behind, because that game is very, very flashy. Um, but still fun. Alright, uh, I don't know if I want to play Dasher. Enemies are killed, summon a spirit. Spirits chase down nearby enemies and deal 8 damage. Okay, that sounds good. And then, I did really like the watering gun, actually. That was very cool. A very neat little weapon. Alright, flame cannon? Yes. Let's do the flame cannon, then. And then we can up our darkness. Small enemies have more HP. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> And we'll try the pumpkin patch. <clears throat> or maybe not, didn't agree with me saying yes, please, please do the play. Thank you. Okay, um, well, flame cannon. Oh, it's, okay, they just call it a flamethrower. <laughs> Come on. Like, why do we gotta play around with pet names for shit? Oh, they do have more health, though. You seem to have more health at any rate. But okay, so it's like we got a natural corpses spawn other things that do damage for me. Um, I think in this run we're probably going to want to focus down on primary bullet damage, though. Since we don't have our extra flower thing doing the work. Um, okay, blah, 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 blah. Okay, reload rate's good. Reload and fire rate. A little tiny buff to fire rate. That's, that's I. And the extra little death spawn things are gonna clean up for us a little bit. Try to lean into the fire as best we can. Speaking of, yeah. Oh, that thing was larger. Oh, nice. Good fucking maneuver there. Just kind of hucked the wall out a little bit. And then we got hit by something that we shouldn't have gotten hit by to begin with. Ow! Hey, buddy! Fucking personal space! Ouchie! Stop it! faster than they need to be. Excuse me, sir. Okay, now we need some mobility, please. Ouch! <laughs> okay, mobility would be good. Let's try that again. That, that build uh, did not take shape quickly enough there. That's all right, no problem. It does look like the flames uh, pierce targets as well, so we'll have to keep that in mind as we're doing a thing here. Uh, Alright, yeah, 
Magnets, magnets, please. How do they work? Looking for our, our double shot would be good too. But alright, fire is good as well. We'll have to see how the enemies progress here. If there's going to be splody ones, we probably don't want to take glare. But if there isn't, I do want to take glare. <laughs> Okay, there's Dragon Friend again. Um, I mean, the, the the massive summon build was great. But I don't know if I'm going to have the time to do that here. I should at least get a little bit of help. The spears will do some work here. doing some work. Okay, power shots would be good. Uh, plus 10 damage for every max HP you have. But we start with slightly larger HP, but no. Primary bullet damage, please, for now. Oop, sir. Yeah, personal space. Idiots. good. Um, okay, let's lean into some lightning. Lightning already doing work. Like it, like it. Alright, this is good. The fucking chain reaction death bullets thing is starting to show. And even more death bullets, okay, sure. <laughs> Excellent. Alright, build's starting to take shape a little bit. Ah, even more fire. Uh, or even more bullets. <laughs> Give. Or even better bullets, rather. Just also grounds for give. bullets or electro bug electro bug please an additional summon to do my work for me thank you Spear upgrade. I was considering Ghost Friend as well. Okay, wow, that fucking idiot went down like a chump. Uh, summons an additional spirit when enemies are killed. Alright, so double death shit. Okay. Give. Oh! <laughs> I love it! Oh, if we can make those things do the on-hit effects too, that's gonna be murderous. And I love it. Um, pick up range plus 20%, every one, okay, sure, yeah, gimme. Oh, that's so good. Like, they don't do much damage on their own, but... <laughs> Fucking self-cleaning arena, I like it.
<laughs> okay, there's movement speed. Thank you. Okay, I almost wish that was a permanent upgrade. Actually, wait, there is a bunch of permanent upgrade shit we can do. I totally forgot about that. The runes and shit that we can buy with our soon-to-be copious amounts of currency. I should really go do that. We've just been playing this 100% rogue style. No permanent upgrades, but you know what? When we're done with this run, we'll go check it out. Um, okay. Well, since we get a boost from max HP, right? Or at least our spears do, right? So, put that up. Now they're doing plus 50 damage. Doing the work. If we can make them faster, that would be even better. God, this is like the fucking Risk of Rain 2 ceremonial daggers. Just endless fucking spawns. I love it. That's such a powerful and also broken item. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, there's our double shot. Finally. Oh, yeah, there we go. What's better than one flamethrower? Two flamethrowers. Two napalm. Oh man, that might be too much though. That might be too much power. Ooh, Tome of Glass. All damage you do is double. Oh, right, this is the Oko one. Ah, uh, <laughs> maybe not. But I think leaning, in, leaning into Tome of Might might be good. Oh, but there's our. Ah, uh, this would have been good for last run, the Tome of Summoning. 50% to summon damage and attack speed. That would have been super good. All right, now let's lean into Toma Might. Even more damage for max health. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Be a big shot. Oh yeah, those are significantly larger shots. I get it. I can see that exactly as advertised. We could somehow get an additional main projectile, like a triple shot, one might call it. That would be super good. Okay, I'm not seeing any explodey enemies, at least in the first six-ish six minutes here. So glare wouldn't be a bad choice either. Um, let's get some ice going. Oh yeah, that's gonna help. Once shit starts popping off for realsies, that'll help. Ooh, careful. <laughs> uh, summon attack speed, uh, lightning. Do we have, we must have the basic bitch lightning, right? Yeah, otherwise we wouldn't have that choice. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, okay, I get it. That adds an extra, extra bullet to our shit here. Or an extra round in our, in our mag. I like that. That's pretty good. Unexpected, but pretty good. Oh, excuse me. A little crowded here. Oh, but hey, we got one of the combo dealabops. When you gain ammo, also gain 35% fire rate. Holy shit. For two seconds. Well, that seems to be proccing pretty often, so yoinkaruski. <laughs> okay. Very good, thank you. Oh, all right. Took a bop there for no real good reason. Just fucking around too long. OK, 
Okay, what else do we got? Uh, don't have any soul heart stuff yet, do we? Increase bullet damage and fire rate by 75% when you get hit. Oh, I don't want to do that. Because I want to get hit. Um, let's put curse in there. Throw curse on everything else. Now manual reload is actually kind of important. <laughs> so we're getting randomly procced additional bullets. Um, every third enemy killed leaves burning ground and inflicts burn for three DPS. Then can quickly regenerates ammo when not shooting if you haven't used up all your ammo. Ooh, that might be a good synergy with our our random additional clip bullets thing. When below seventy five percent of max ammo, deal two times more burn damage. Holy shit. Or flame cannon shoots much slower at his 30 base damage. Holy fuck. Burn damage is increased by bonuses to bullet damage. Uh, no, I think I like overclock there. Like, give me more of everything. Don't run it dry. Like, short controlled bursts, right? And then suddenly everything is immediately better. Um, every fifth shot launch a fireball. Okay, even more fire, yeah. <laughs> okay, this is good. This is good shit. Now we just need the run and gun one that keeps our speed up whilst we're firing. Um, okay, there's the soul heart stuff that we probably want. Give us a little extra cushion, you know? Alright, this is a good, like, primary fire build now. Emphasis on both primary and fire. Uh, okay. And he's inflicted with freeze. Yoink, Iruski. More damage done to it, right? I think that's what I saw in there. I saw more damage and I took it. I don't think anybody could blame me for that. Um, even more burn damage, okay. Oh, and shooting your last ammo. Oh, we're hardly doing our last ammo anymore. Um, increased lightning damage. Yoink. Now we just need something that uh, heals us on every, like, 10 millionth kill or whatever, and then we'll be fine. Max HP plus 2? Oh, but we also get 25% larger. You know what? I'm interested. Gimme. Like, we don't seem... Okay, I guess we are a little bit larger. That's fine. Like, whatever. That burn 0.05%. Yeah, right? Was it just on burn, or was it just uh, a straight up 1 in 2,000 chance? I don't remember now. See, it feels like so long ago. <laughs> I don't remember what skill tree that was a part of either. Okay, there we go. Every 500th enemy killed by a summon. Okay, we don't have very many summons. But we've got spears, though. They'll do some work. This fucking clip regen is sick as hell. Ow, excuse me. Hey. 
Back off. First in space. Get some. And also respect some. <laughs> Oh, we can uh, cut the reload short, which is good because it just fucking we get the one The extra bullet proc and then suddenly we've got a bullet in the clip and then it just recharges right away from there. I love it Um, Okay, there's run and gun good Excellent, so now we don't slow down at all I guess whilst we're firing that's pretty handy Excuse me. Okay, I think we got it. Okay, that was the soul heart proc that I just heard there. Oh, ow, hey. Excuse me. Okay, things are getting a little, a little stupid here now. Ow! Ooh, yeah. Uh, excuse me. I need kind of health and I need it now. When lightning strikes an enemy that is burning, increase an explosion that deals 25 damage. Hot damn. Uh, yeah, that's another combo thing. Uh, careful. Uh oh. Uh, this might be a problem. Uh, oh no! Oh no! Ah! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> oh fuck! All right, that was a fun. That was a fun little build. That was a fun little build. Lots of lots of fire. Lots of fire. Lots of flames. I like it. Okay, I completely forgot about the perma upgrades. Let's see what we got. Um. Just straight up damage boost, fire rate and reload, uh, just straight up burn or freeze, oh man. Vision range and pickup range, gain fire rate and knockback on low health, a hey, more reload rates. Jeez, wow. Like, we've got 32,000 monies. Okay, uh, gimme. One, two, three, four, five. Yoink. What is that? Five times 1350 is 5,650, 5, right? Okay. That seems a, a worthwhile expenditure of funds. Do we have to wait on these? We really don't. We can just go right for it, huh? Oh, but it costs so much more for all these. Heal one HP every fifth level. Gain 4% more XP per rank. Oh shit, give. Oh, I can't do it. Ah, I see, I oh, need little shits. <laughs> uh, pick up XP, blah, 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 blah. Okay, sure. Oh, I see, we can only equip Two things, I see. I see what's going on, I think. I don't know. Actually, I'm not 100% sure what's going on here. Okay, it looks like we can only equip two of the whatevers per thing. Maybe? Or, oh, we can only equip one per column. I see. I, no, that's not true either. What? What's the restriction here? Why can I only do two? Oh, maybe per row. Maybe per row per category. Let's just upgrade one of these per and see what we got. Oh, but we got to unlock that. God damn. Okay, that's expensive. 
Okay, there we go. We have to get to three per to unlock the next row. Uh, shooting your last ammo, deal the damage, blah, 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 blah. And inflicting version of burn 50 times, gain 50% fire rate and reload rate for one second per rank. 3% uh, extra damage per rank while within your vision range. Shit. Yeah, give me. Give me that shit. Okay, yeah. Okay, so it's one per row per category. I get it. I get it. Okay. So give me that. And, uh... Dodge chance plus 2% per rank. But it caps at 60%. So every 3 and 5 hits, we could not take a hit. That's pretty good. Two sides and corners that knocks back nearby enemies every 10 seconds. One second faster per rank. Interesting. Well, this gets real expensive real fast, doesn't it? Okay. Alright, see if that was like, equip everything all at once, I think it would be just massively overpowered. So I like that they limited. Um, and we should have enough money for at least one character and or... Oh, we just unlocked this one. Periodically summon a tentacle that attacks enemies for 30 damage. Sold. And then we can unlock another weapon. Crossbow. Hold the shoot button to charge. Charging gives more damage and piercing gear bullets. Alright, I'm into it. Give. Yeah. Alright, standard and then darkness. Okay, yep. We good. Uh, let's go back to forest for now. Oh, 122 damage. Hot damn. Okay, this will definitely be the... It's like the sniper wolf equivalent of shit here, which... I don't know if I'm into that. It feels like we would, uh... We're better served by volume of output rather than precision of output. Faster reload rate, faster move speed. Alright, we're gonna have to line up our shots anyways, right? Man, even the... Okay, so the quick fire is the base 20. But you let it charge for a bit and suddenly we're doing trip digits. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. I think we're gonna need some cover. <clears throat> need some things to do some cover for us whilst we're charging up. Max is out at 122 presently. That's still a lot of damage, though. It's got not bad, like, hit radius to it, either. It's not extremely precise. But it is a little slower than one would want, I think, typically. Okay, crossbow's not, not doing much for me here. But it's an interesting weapon, for sure. I guess it's probably best for single target damage, right? So the big boss dipshits are gonna be murdered pretty quick with this. And or we've got the long range unlock as long as our aim is true. Hmm, I wonder if this covers charging as well? It sure does! Awesome, okay. Mobility needs have been achieved. Um, okay, a bit more close-in protection too. I'm into that. It's the opposite of the the bat gun run we had last time. Um mm, 
additional speed. I don't think we need additional bullet speed. Um, let's get our spears up to snuff here. Okay, they'll protect us more or less from anything that's about to, to bear down for a few more minutes. Okay. Higher vision range, I like that. I guess these bosses have a fair amount of- oh no, he's dead, never mind. <laughs> Seven tentacles twice as often, yoink! Okay, yeah, our, our butts are gonna be covered for a, a dang long time. Increase bullet damage and move speed by 10% every 10 seconds. Resets when you get hit. Uh, well, we haven't been getting hit, so yoink. Just play perfect and we'll be fine. Considering we hardly need to use primary fire at all here, at least for now. Okay, looks like our damage is capping out at 140 something now. One's fell, I'm sorry, 152. Ha, ah, double shot, yeah, there we go, now we're talking. <laughs> Excellent. Saw 157s out of that. Can we? Did we confirm that we could destroy these trees before? If we're defended enough, let's let's try it. Let's give it a try. Or an out 300 per shot, pretty much. At least I think near the end of the run we were able to destroy them because they were getting all uppity and trying to get to us. Uh, plus 10 damage for every max HP. Faster reload rates. Uh, do tentacles count as summons? I guess we'll find out. They're doing 40 at a crack. That seems pretty good. That seems extremely good, in fact. Attack speed plus 20% and inflict burn. Yeah, please. Please do. <laughs> this boss is just gonna go down like a dumbass chump. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of, Yoink, uh, Tomo Might is a pretty good one. Just Generally, fire rate plus 66%, spread plus, plus 60. Um, that would have been good for the bat gun, I think. Bullet bounce plus two bullet damage. No, no, tell them might, I think. So now if we get the whole damage boost per max health for the spears, that would be good. Am I able to get rid of this sooner rather than later? No, I think once it gets small enough, it just kind of goes away on its own, right? This little area restriction. Even more bullet damage. Uh, uh, damage from glare also applies on hit effects from bullets. Oh man. Uh, twice as often for glare. And you know what? We'll take that first. And then we'll do the the glare does bullet effects and shit, because that's gonna be... Well, I mean, I don't think we have anything yet, do we? We don't have any lightning or fire or whatever, so... Lean into that a bit, I think. Yeah, I mean, we pretty much 
let's just stay stationary. We're doing enough damage output between the glare and the tentacles and all that. It's just not... Not even required for us to fire. Like, this would be a good summon build, I think, too. Summon damage by 1% after every 15 enemies killed? Uh, yeah. I think we've pretty much confirmed that the tentacles count, right? So they're doing... Can't even get a good read on what they're doing. 29? Maybe a little bit more? Oh, guess we've already got the spears, too. So that's gonna do some work. Double 160s on a full charge shot here. Not bad at all, and then there's the other glare effects thing. Ah, uh, but I do like this. Like, all the summon upgrades are just incredibly good. So, yoink. Give me that. 15% chance for insta kills, right? Considering our total volume of summon output here, like, that's gonna do the thing. We could get Ghost Friend up in here, too. That pretty much seals it. Okay, yeah, now the trees are getting uppity. Oh, look at it! It's dead. <laughs> look at that, it was dead. Incredible. Um, okay, there's Ghost Friend, yep. Yeah, it looks like that other tree ate shit already, too. Okay, there's a couple more. Wonder if the 15% applies to these, or if these dudes are considered bosses. Oh, no, that guy got deleted. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even get a chance to hit him with a charge shot. They're just fucking dead immediately. I love it. Um, okay. Uh, let's put some lightning on there. I think we have the, the glare effects thing, right? Um, or did we not? No, we took the double the double glare first, so we need the glare effects yet. By the time we get it, we'll probably have a couple other <clears throat> elements assigned, like freeze or whatever. Oh no, never mind, it's right there. <laughs> Yoink. Glare range at maximum here, unless we can do perhaps one additional that we can grab at next few level ups here. Oh, or we can get this. Uh, move speed plus 25%, walk speed plus 100%, hot damn. Bullets damage is increased by bonuses to move speed. Near bullets reach the edge of the screen, they warp around. Oh, that's fucking sick as hell. Charge is much faster. No, no, no. Give me the screen ramp. Ah, that's so good. Okay, it wraps twice. I like that. I like that a lot, in fact. Oh god, screen wrapping shit is so good. I mean, we might have to do something about the spread. But that might actually be better to have it like that than not to get the random ass kills, right? Uh, okay. Uh... You know what? Let's get random ass soul hearts every 500th enemy, right? Like, I wasn't too sure about this crossbow, but then they put some screen wrapping on this, and it's just like, oh man. Okay. <laughs> Alright then. Like, now I'm a sucker if I don't full charge, really, because it's essentially Oko for whatever it hits. 
Um, okay, there's the soul heart gain there. And automatically refill three of my amp. What does that mean for our single shot crossbow, I wonder? I guess we'll see. Or maybe we won't, because it's not going to proc on time before the reload happens. Mm, that might have been a... Might have been a dead upgrade to grab. Oh well. That's what I get for trying to experiment a little bit. Oh well. That's fine. Like we can we can duff up one upgrade. It's like we don't not like we don't have 21 others where that came from. Ten for every max health. <laughs> Yoink. <laughs> yeah, boy, that screen wrap really clears the path for you. Which is good, because I need paths cleared. Okay, there. It procced and then it gave me the bullet back before the uh, reload happened. That's interesting. That's not terribly useful, but it is fun. Oops, ouch. Excuse me. Oh yeah, no doubt it's better for different weapons, since it said plus three, and we're on a single shot to begin with, right? Uh, I'll take the max health, that'll improve our uh, spear damage output too. Dead yet? Okay, he's dead. Very good. Oops, excuse me. Ow! Hey! Watch it. Uh, tentacles attack another twice as often. Okay. <laughs> okay, I mean, we're double spawning them and they're attacking twice as often. Very good. doing not unreasonable damage for swipe too which is super fun and awesome okay soul heart every 90 seconds yes i will need to get some survival here oh yeah especially when i do that dumb idiot bullshit huh Okay, yeah, we need more damage output somehow. <laughs> Excuse me. Having the barely affected movement speed while start charging is uh, helping as well. Ooh, okay. Oh! oh. <laughs> Damn it. I needed a soul heart to proc sooner than that happened, but uh, no such luck. Okay, I mean, not, not bad. That was a very weird build to have gotten as far as it did. 
Uh, okay. Um, you know what? No, we're, just, we're good on the permanent upgrade things for now. Uh, let's unlock another character and, and do the thing here. Okay, the last one we got is this. Every 10 seconds. 10 seconds is a lot of time. Temporarily transform into a deer. While in deer form, you're invincible and deal 100 damage to enemies you run over. Storm damage increased by summon damage and move speed. Okie dokes. Um, and then, okay, you know what? I'm feeling just a standard shotgun. And let's go pumpkin patch because we unlock another character for a clear there. Okay, that's kind of a... an underwhelming shotgun. <laughs> It doesn't have a. It doesn't have like. Oh geez. Okay. Ten seconds, right? How long does this last? I wonder. Is it every ten? Is like like ten on, ten off type shit? Maybe. Let's give more more speed. Let's see if that's the case. Ten on. Ten ish off. Okay. Yep. Yeah. We need more pop. We need more pop on the shotgun. I know they intentionally did the whole very soft firing noise. Which is good, like it should be subtle and understated. But I feel like for the shotgun, they could have maybe broken that rule, but... Giving it a bit more pizzazz, some more zing, you know? Some more crunch. Give me a good old crunchy shotgun. Uh, speaking of, power shot, thank you. Okay, like every 10 seconds, that procs fairly frequently, and it lasts forever, too, so... Hmm, I can see this being good with, uh, double shot, too. Uh, move speed plus 10%, yeah, okay. Our shit scales on move speed, right? Oh, yeah, look at that. Love it. I guess if our uh, deer form is going to be doing the majority of the damage, right? So I'll sink everything into movement. Most things into movement, right? With uh, an occasional survival thing every now and again. Since our main weapon is probably not going to carry us here very, very much at all. Whilst we can run down the trash mobs every 10 seconds. May as well do it, right? Uh, okay, let's uh, move uh, Ghost Friend. A little bit more output. Really, it just becomes a matter of avoid shit for 10 seconds and then immediately do not avoid shit for 10 seconds. Okay, anything movement related. Yeah, pick up range, sure. This might get interesting if we get poor timing when big boss idiots start showing up. Oh, ow. glare as well, just for some additional movement, or additional damage out at close range. Yeah, having a little timer for when the transform is about to happen is would be a pretty good add. I mean, you get the little flash, oh jeez, that guy eats shit. 
Okay, there's the double shot. You do get the little flashy bit for when you don't, uh, when you're about to leave that form, right? Carriage size plus 50% move speed plus 30% summon damage plus 30. Hell yeah. Okay, anything that fucking. Oh wow. <laughs> oh my god, we're, we're big now. We're very large. Oh, and it didn't double our shoddy output, it just added an projectile to it. That's gross. Um, I think our transformation does count for summon. Yeah. Because it said movement speed and uh, summon damage affect the damage output. Oh, okay, and we... Okay, we're fire, just firing shotgun forever. Uh, both sides deal 10% for every soul heart you currently have. No. Soul heart increased max limit of soul hearts by two. You know, let's get some spears going too. So apparently we fired on the same frame of our transformation, so we're just a, a shotgun firing deer now. Oh, that's over. I can see this run going some good distance, since the deer transformation seems to be perhaps a little bit overpowered. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining about it, but my goodness, when you can fucking Oko everything for 10-ish seconds, like that seems good. Shotgun sounds like one of those B rate horror movies. Wow! B rate, huh? That's being real generous! <laughs> that is being real generous. Okay, summon damage seems good. Oh, immediately into it. So, what are we doing? I'm seeing 200s there. 279, I think. That's a lot of damage to be doing. As soon as we transform again, this guy is fucking done. Like, he's not living. Come here. I dare you. Head to head. Let's go. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, stop bite being bopped out of bounds. Come on, man. Little shitter. There we go. <laughs> uh, ooh, Tome of Power. Oh, no. We need the one that makes us move faster. Um, uh, piercing max HP minus one? That's kind of dangerous. I don't like any of these. I suppose we could not take one. But it would be a shame to not take one. So I'll take the Tome of Power then. Oh, those shotgun bullets are big now. And it's, it's not like our fire rate was ever in question anyways. I do kind of miss the that max health we lost. Oh well, I'm sure we'll be fine. It's not gonna matter. Oh, even more, even larger bullets. Um, okay, well let's beef up our summons. Kinda leaning into the summon build again, which... You know, honestly, we've gotta clear with it before, so I'm not... not gonna turn down a summon build. To win. That's right! Like, see? Like, the minimum amount of health you need is one. Anything else just holds you back, weighs you down, etc., right? We have learned this. I made a movie called Zombievers? Oh, come on! No, you, you gotta be making that up. Get out of here. Come on. We don't countenance lying around these parts, although I totally believe that's a thing, honestly. Okay, summon. Ghost friend doing more work here. Oh, I'm afraid to click that IMDB link now. <laughs> oh no.
All right, so if there's a movie, oh, jeez, I'm glad I transformed there. If there's a movie called Zombievers, and we all know, like, don't don't deny it, we all know that Rule Thirty Four is a thing that exists. What do you think the porn version of that movie is called? Or is that too racy to be talking about on Twitch? Who gives a shit? Fuck it. What do you think the porn version of that movie is called? No wrong answer. Well, there might be some wrong answers, but no wrong answers. Because, <laughs> like, half of the name is already pretty much there, right? So you really just need to come up with the second half. Fire rate. What happened? All did we get all the movement ones already? All right, whatever. I wonder if whilst we're in our deer form here, does that count as a summon kill? Because if so, we about to get more soul hearts. Every 500 kills. Ouch! Excuse me. That's all right. Oh, especially when they group up like this. That's great. Um, okay, uh, 10% damage for each soul heart, blah, 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 you know what, no, let's put some fire on there. Oh, this is gonna be about, uh, managing our personal space a little bit now. <laughs> uh, haha. Um... Okay, uh, boop, bop, boop, 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 bop, boop. Alright, it's gonna be about managing personal space, and we need to up our main weapon a bit. Because we're gonna rely on. Ow! Shit. <laughs> we're gonna rely on deer form to. To get us through everything. Uh, okay. There's summon attack speed. That should help us. You're looking for funny racing movie tests. Someone also made a movie called Frank. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. I mean, that pretty much gives away the whole movie. Like, where's where's the intrigue? Where's the intrigue in a movie named like that? Come on, I know exactly what's gonna happen. Uh, okay, um... Uh, vision range? Yeah, okay, that helps us out with, the uh, glare, right? I mean, whilst we're talking about, like, terrible movies, right? I am still- oh, I'm, I'm about to die, aren't I? I'm still really fucking kind of shocked that they got Samuel L. Jackson to do the fucking snakes on a plane shit. Like, was he really that hard up for money that he would do a movie like that? Like, what the hell? And, you know, full disclosure, I've never seen it. Maybe it's actually a good movie. Who knows? But it just seems so really dumb and stupid. Like, why would it... Good gravy. Um, alright. Uh, projectiles. Oh, fewer projectiles, but then bullet is huge. Okay, dual wield. An additional shotgun that shoots behind you. That's pretty good. And then bullet damage, more projectiles, more piercing, more bullet size, and more spread. Increased damage, but reduces range. Oh, well, let's do dual wield then. I think we're at the the single oh yeah there we go <laughs> there there's our Kimbo shoddy oh we might be dead 
Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> that crowd gets awful thick awful fast. Okay, I'm disappointed in the shotgun. That that did not feel like a good weapon at all. To besmirches the shotgun's shotgun family's good name, honestly. Um, alright. So we've done all the normal ass unlocks. We just need to survive pumpkin patch for that one. Okay. Um I also didn't mind the character. It was pretty fun. Um, I did like Lilith, though. Like, the whole fucking natural death bullets thing is pretty sick. So let's do that, and then I guess we just got magic bow left, huh? Alright, let's give it a try. Shoot out arrows that linger on the ground. When you reload, arrows return to you and deal damage to- okay. Uh, it retrieves them, and then they do more damage. Okay, sure, let's give it a try. Give it a try, eh? Okay, that's interesting, not- ooh, that seems a bit more strategic than I would have wanted out of my weapons, to be honest with you. Oh, it doesn't have the charge time of the crossbow, which is honestly pretty good. And wherever they land, huh, okay. Alright, well, let's double up projectiles again, because, uh, hell yeah. Hmm, very interesting. Very interesting. And then an additional one behind us, which seems like... Like, volume output for this seems like the good play. Let's do that. Oh, excuse me. Especially when the crowd starts getting thick. Oh, excuse me. Alright, I'm... Trouble discerning the hitboxes a bit. Right, this does feel like a very thinky weapon, and I'm not sure how I feel about that just yet. Like, maybe the crossbow was the maximum amount of think I can handle for tonight, anyways. There we go, there's even more projectiles. Yeah, gimme. There we go, that's better. Okay, I can sort of get behind this now. Even if I'm probably not doing optimal whatevers. Definitely seems like a crowd clear once we get it really up there. Feels like perhaps we shouldn't be relying too much on the primary weapon damage either. Considering how much thinking this requires now. Mostly gonna be a path clearer and let everything else do the work. Or reload. Reload seems good, actually. Yeah, okay, and that's already better. I think it counts as a summon, but I would like my spears to do some work for sure. And also, we need the the dumb and the the double summon spawn 
from last run with Lilith here. That was pretty fucking good. Okay, alright, that guy vaporized pretty good. Alright, when you focus down on a single target, that definitely works. 35% uh, move speed for one second where an enemy is killed. Really? Well, shit's gonna be dying immediately all the time. <laughs> I, I can get behind that though, like, don't... Oh, interesting. You can kick off a reload sooner and then fire off the rest of the bullets and then it... Oh, that seems like it shouldn't be possible. Uh, alright, well, if we're gonna lean into some max HP shenanigans here. Kick it off and then fire the last burst. It doesn't really stop the reload, does it? That's interesting. Uh, I probably don't have the presence of mind to do that most times. say we need the, these things to be doing more damage. There we go. That's better. 20 at a crack instead of 15 is significant. I hate to say this, but this is better than the shotgun. I mean, with its current upgrades, I suppose. Because it's piercing, it's got way better range, and it's got the return damage on it, so it's just like, eh, okay. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's play the long game. Let's get some soul heart boost damage going on once we get some soul hearts. next desired level up here, a source of soul hearts, whether that's time or kills or whatever the heck else it might be. Okay, this dude's a bit harder to vaporize when he's moving around like that. <clears throat> Little damage plus 20% and pierce- well, I mean, we already have piercing. I'd take it for the damage itself. Get some curse going too. There we go, that's better. Let's see what we got. Can we get okay, the health one is probably the the good one there. Six max health, so that's plus twelve damage just straight away. I'm into it. Every 500th killed by a summon. Uh, that might not be good, actually. Okay, max ammo plus two might be good here. Gimme. So that gives us, what, six on the field then? Yeah. All right. Huh. Okay, maybe I was being a bit hasty before uh, Kind of discounting the effectivity of this weapon. Let's get more of it out there. Seems all right. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're definitely gonna need some speed though. Oh, 
Well, it took a bop there from something. Might have been an actual bullet. Okay, there's that again, and then blah blah blah, more damage, blah blah blah, additional 100% curse damage, yoink. Hmm. I've seen someone beat Hades on 64 heat difficulty. Oh man, no. I forget where I ended up with uh, after all was said and done. I feel like I hit double digits, but I. 64 sounds just unhealthy. <laughs> 64 sounds like it's very unhealthy. Um, increase bullet damage by 50% for one second after reloading. No. Okay, there's the soul heart stuff. Let's lean into that a bit. Because I'm guessing that that sounds like maximum. Because I'm sure people are out there that have done maximum heat on Hades, right? That sounds like a thing people would do. Perhaps not this person, but <laughs> it sounds like a, a thing people would do. Only one person, huh? Huh. That seems wild to me, just on its face, really. I figured you would, there would be more than one person being able to do that. But knowing what most of the heat things in Hades actually do, like, I guess that's not that surprising. Because I can imagine stacking all that up would be, uh, certainly be something. Now, what the... Hmm. Keep our soul hearts going here because that's, uh, contributing to damage output. Sirs, personal space, please. Okay, we have to be a, a bit more particular about our firing here. Uh, engineers can now apply on hit effects when they return, and a 20% chance to call down lightning. Uh, arrows no longer return to you, instead, they explode for three times bullet damage when you reload. Okay. Arrows deal no damage on impact, but three times the damage on returning. Ah, oh, man. Like, bomb arrows and arrow caller seems very situational. Thunder caller seems like the only 100% good thing. Give, give that one, please. Oh my god, yeah, doing the lightning on the way out is pretty good. Oh, oh geez, wow, and then their bullets. I, got, I did not track their bullets very well, so they murdered me immediately. Oops. Okay. I mean, Magic Bow was kind of a, a downer. It was better than the shotgun, but it, that's a, a low bar to clear. Uh, okay, it's getting late, but I feel like we've got one more. We've got one more in us here. Um, did we get all of the weapons now? Yeah, okay, we've got all the weapons. And we're just missing that final character unlock, really. Um... So given that we've got that, let's lean into this a bit, huh? And this, I guess. Okay, I mean, that seems fine for now. Uh, I do like fire. And if we get something that multi, if we take a weapon that multi-shots, like dual smigs, Yoinkarooski there. Let's see if we can do the last character unlock yet for the last run of tonight. All right, it's got an extremely long reload time. All right, we'll have to solve that problem sooner rather than later. Uh, okay. Do you uh, happen to have a link to that particular run? 
because I would watch that 100%. Knowing that I would probably, well, I don't want to say never, but it's almost certain that I would probably not be able to do a run like that. I would like to see someone else do a run like that, just for grinsies, you know? Um, okay, you know what? Let's lean into the dragon. Let's let's do a let's do a dragon build here. Feeling good about our RNG possibilities. Oh yeah, that's right. I suppose you would have to unlock just the ability to do a 64 heat run as well. Okay, yeah. There's probably no way I would have the patience for that then. I've got so much other shit to do, like, there's no way I could feasibly do something like that. Ah, oh, damn it, of course they curse me with no extra dragon thing. Uh, give me spears then. Ah, there, okay, there's another dragon bit. Do it. Oh, excuse me, sir. Back off. Yeah, I guess it would be very early boon, especially dependent, right? Uh, okay, let's scrap magnetism for now. Not the dragon specific one that I wanted to see there, so we can afford to dump it into general utility. belief that Dragon Friendo will will make this run. We'll get ready for it. Hey, there's another well I mean it's not a dragon specific one, but it is a summon based one. Man, Hades is such a good game. I should play that again. Maybe that moves closer to the top of the list for a, a Sunday long play. Again. That's such a good game. Ah! I need dragon buffs here. What the fuck? RNG, please. Or Hades 2 drops. Was that, um... Did they say they were working on a, a Hades 2? <laughs> I feel like that's something I read at one point, but then I promptly forgot. Is that a thing they're doing? Like, I'd be all for it if they were, but I'd also understand if they chose not to, honestly. Like, it's a good game in its own right. It doesn't need a sequel. Ah, man. Oh, did they have a trailer? Really? Oh, that's rad. Okay. Something to look forward to. I gotta say, like, the... The likelihood of a sequel doing well has really... Or, or being a good game. Let's not even factor doing well into it. The likelihood of a sequel being a really good game has been pretty good. Like, I've got a lot of number two games in my library that are just really fucking great. Uh, burn lasts twice as long. Hell yeah, give me. It's like, it used to be... It used to be, and I, it might still be true, that whenever there was a sequel, it's just like, oh yeah, like, what? how are they gonna fuck it up type shit. Nowadays, it's like, oh, the sequel... Oh, it's gonna be awesome, right? Um... Okay, let's... Lean into summon damage, I guess. It seems that tide has turned. Maybe, perhaps not super recently. 
But I definitely remember sequels generally being kind of more suspicious than probably awesome. In perhaps not so recent history, but definitely recallable history. Alright, fine, give me piercing then. Oh, oh, dragon friend is hatched. Okay, didn't even notice. Well, hopefully he'll, he'll do enough for us to make it worthwhile. We've got at least one of the specific dragon things. The specific dragon time-based things, rather. So, that, that should be enough, I would hope. That's true. Yeah, that's true. I can see that. Not having... not that particular studio not having experience with sequels, right? And Hades being such a fucking banger out the gate. Yeah, they've got a... a high bar to clear. That's for damn sure. I will not deny that. But even so... Even so, I've I've got I don't want to say I've got faith because faith is kind of a weird thing to have, but I have trust in super giant games that they can pull it off. They've got a damn fine history behind them. Oh man, that guy went down like a chump. Okay, what do we got? Rage summoning. Summoning might actually be the thing here. Ooh. Yeah, let's go with summoning. Even if that's gonna fucking torpedo our reload rate super hard. Oh my god, that's terrible. But alright, summons are gonna have to make up the difference. There we go. Like the 15% instant kill chance. Just have to be a bit more judicious about what we choose to fire at. ourselves plenty of time for like what what is now like a three and a half second reload wow that's feels like forever man eight months ago huh what the fuck was i doing eight months ago that i missed that i guess i don't actively pay attention to reveals and announces and shit like that especially since it feels like everybody's always announcing that they're gonna announce something and by that point, I'm just like, you know what? Just fucking announce it. Don't, don't try to hype up your announce. Just do it. But whatever. I, okay, I'm super jazzed that there's gonna be a Hades too. Then, like, that's cool as hell. Um, all right, let's try to improve our reload rate a bit. Ooh, that did not improve the reload rate very much at all. That's still bad. Uh, Alright, thank you. Yeah, I'll check out the trailer, too, for sure. That's cool shit. That's good shit. Good times. Good times for that stuff, at least. I mean, times in general are pretty shitty. I don't feel bad about saying that, but, you know, every now and again, a, a bright spot is good. Uh, 10 damage for every max HP. We don't have a lot of max HP. And we're leaning into summons, right? Oh, no Zagreus, huh? Well, that's alright. That's alright. I feel like, you know, it's probably a good time for... for Zagreus to just, you know, take take a take a rest. Take, have a little snooze. He's done a lot. He, he deserves a little break. Well, that makes me curious about uh, who's going to be the Hades 2 protag then. If it's Dusa, like, I'd be all over that. Um, okay, ghost friend. Can you imagine? <laughs> Can you imagine if the protag for Hades 2 was Dusa? Oh, man. That would be something. 
I feel like they could make that happen, and it would be awesome. Oh, right, yeah, I feel like I had heard that it was going to be uh, the daughter of Hades instead. I feel like that's a, a small detail that penetrated my dumb mind brain at some point. Uh, do we have any, like, summon shit here? No? Uh, okay, fire then. for Dragon Front here. Oh, hey, there. There's the other fucking time dragon thing. I guess we got 11 minutes left, huh? We can get 160% damage. Okay, and then the piercing on the SMGs is doing enough work. To give us enough room to work with here. Every 10th shot lands a wave of lightning strikes. Also have a 20% chance to inflict burn. 10% chance to inflict frozen. And then does 400% damage against frozen enemies. Hmm. None of those is bad. I feel like every 10th shot seems a bit low. Go with fire. I like fire. And I guess we are playing the fire character, right? So that's like that tracks. Oh, we need something with uh need some health. <laughs> We're gonna have to do that next level, I guess, because, uh, no health stuff there. Let's take some lightning. There we go. Every 500th enemy killed by a summon. Or the soul shield thing. Uh, you know what, let's take the bloodsuckers and hope for the best. Dragon friend is doing work. The spears are doing work. Feel like we'll get to 500 in more or less no time, right? Just gotta let him do some work. Not fire on our own. There's just a straight up uh, vitality. We'll take the damage boost per 15 seconds. the lightning effects from our summons count as their kills. Uh, 500th enemy killed by a summon drops a soul heart. Okay, well, let's lean into that 500th enemy drops the heals type thing. Just gonna be on the lookout for those drops now, too, because I don't think it's doesn't grant me it automatically. We have to actually go pick it up. Uh, okay, this ghost friend getting an upgrade there too.
we go. Bolt steel additional damage equal to 10% of your dragon's damage. Or... Or get another summon. Or get a shield. An anti-fuck-up device. Okay. Anti-fuck-up device seems the, the smarter play. One anti-fuck-up device, please. Oh, very good. <laughs> it has already done its job. drops from the 500th kills here, please. Whoa, okay. Careful. 10% fire rate every time she inflicts burn, resets, and reload. Okay, that's fine. Oh, boy! <laughs> Okay, yep, that's a that's a clip emptier if ever I've seen one. Oh, excuse me. Except when I expect to have a bullet or two left for emergencies. Ah. <laughs> uh, oh, careful. Oh, okay, this is dangerous now somehow. <laughs> Um, oh yeah, this is very dangerous now. Uh, oh, double shooties. Double shooties, please. Oh, <laughs> um, 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 um. Okay, crowds are getting thick. Uh. Uh. Uh oh. <laughs> um. Okay, we got our anti-fuck-up back. Alright, that's good. This is fine. Oh, and there it goes. Shit. Um... <laughs> uh, let's get it slightly to help us out, just in case. <laughs> Extra damage to clear the way. Oh, careful, that guy wasn't dead. Okay, well, maybe the scythe being around will help do the fucking 500 kills and shit. I feel like it's crazy, at least 15% max HP. Oh, give me. we've got enough close-in protection to save us from stupid things. But this is getting a little sketchy. I would like at least one more health. Uh, crap. <laughs> uh, we're fast to reload, I guess. That's good, too. Oh, wow. It's getting a little dicey. OK, 
Okay. Oh shit! Oh shit! That guy just came screaming in. I don't know what his story was. Uh. I need him to not move so fast. And get frozen forever, please. Uh, okay, there's the max HP plus one, sure. <laughs> Just in case. Oh, goodness. Oh, okay, he's dead. Very good. It's a little close. Uh, another max HP minus one. No! <laughs> uh, bullet bounce? Sure, that sounds fun. It doesn't seem to affect our fire bits, so that's fine, I guess. Okay, we made it through like the dense crowd waves right before that boss, so that's that's good. Honestly, our problem is probably gonna oh okay. Problem is probably gonna be just the last few bosses. And some crowd control here. Okay, yeah, that guy's dead. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Alright. Uh bullet damage and burn damage. Okay, you know, fine, whatever. Burn is probably doing more work than anything else anyways. A very burn focused character, right? Uh, okay, even more burn damage. Or, oops, I'll just take the general bullet damage too. That works. Okay, it looks like we gained a, an additional health in there somewhere, so we picked something up that I did not see. That was probably the every 500 kills bit. There we go, there's the extra burn damage again. I haven't seen the soul heart drop yet either. We got that slightly after the actual health drop thing. Safe bit. Okay, there's the soul heart drop that we just picked up. Every 90 seconds, get a soul heart. <laughs> well, we don't really, I don't think we would need an extra one of those now. Every 20, every 22 damage every second while Holy Shield is active. Okay, well, we're doing pretty well at defending ourselves, so. Extra lightning. Increase reload rate and move speed, hell yeah. Pulse shield is active. Okay, reload rate is approaching standard now. As long as we've got our shield up, that'll continue to be the case. Uh, and you inflict burn, there's a- okay, here's the every two, one in 2,000, right? <laughs> uh, alternatively, and eh, no, let's take it, just for grins. Got a, a minute 20 to make use of it. 
And we're already doing a lot of burn the way it is, right? So, who knows? Oh yeah, look at that. We've already got full health again. Fucking rad. There's level 40. Incredible. Okay. Holy shield now regenerates in one minute. Well, that doesn't make any damn sense. Shooting last ammo. Do a smite. I don't know quite what the attack pattern on that is. But I hear it. I hear it through the little shimmer at the end. Oh, okay. There goes the shield. That sucks got way less reload rate. Oh, bonk. That's right. Ow. Oh, I felt another hit there. There's normal electro, and then additional scythe damage. Which I think we're good for another 10 seconds, right? There's no way this is gonna go poorly. We did it! And we got the last character unlock. Hooray! <laughs> and we survived, I guess, secondary. Um, okay. Not bad. Not bad. Was that two, three-ish clears? Three-ish clears, I think. Um, which is pretty good for one night's work, I would suppose. Good enough, at any rate. Um, okay. Uh, it's getting pretty late, so we'll call it there for tonight. So, uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CDT. It'll be Shmup Book Club. So we've got, um, the new Shmup for month of September coming up. We'll know that tomorrow. Um, a new quarterly coming up. We should also know that tomorrow. And Soap Star is still on the block as well. Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT, it'll be long play. Uh, we've got several options open to us. Uh, Noida, of course, being there. Darkest Dungeon 2 is on the list as well. Um, 30 XDX is on that list, even though we just got done with it, really. Um, and possibly Hades gets added back to that list, too. Who knows, since we were talking about it tonight. Um, but then next Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, I think we can get at least one more of 20 minutes till dawn in here. There's enough to do. We've got to try Endless Bode um, and do maybe a few more character stupid weird meme runs, right? Um, and then next Wednesday, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll see if we do more 20 minutes till dawn there, if we sw swap to something new kind of midweek. Lots to think about, but good stuff all the way around. So that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.